today I bring you a brand new series. I've been really looking forward to it. Forward to it. Today's Tuesday. So I'll bring you 10 useless fact Tuesday. See, I got my phone up here. And on this phone are 10 facts that I deem useless. But I'm going to tell you anyways. Because I know that you'll watch it. But uh, I'm going to do this Tuesday. Every Tuesday for the rest of the summer. Or for the rest of the show being alive. Just so you know. And I'm also going to try to do it Thursday. Just so you guys know. So, let's get into the video. Oh, but first, before I go, there would not be a Stockman show for Friday. Let me look at my calendar over here. Whatever. This Friday, is, there's going to be a Stockman show. But next Friday, there won't. This Tuesday, facts. Next Tuesday, not. And uh, also, leave down in the comments below if I should do this on Thursday, too. So I have it two times during the week. So, like, 20 facts during the week just to kind of have. Because this is really fun and I enjoy it. And I might do it anyways, but just something to think down below. Thank you, and uh, I'll see you at the end of the video. I'll uh, see you at the end of the video. Let's go. Fact number one a U.S. nickel has one in 6,000 of a chance of landing on its edge when you flip it. I really want to try that out, but one in 6,000 is pretty bad odds. Fact number two no matter how long you watch an object, go into a black hole, you'll never actually see it enter the black hole due to time dilation. So it means that like this was like a like warp portal that was going like this and entering the hole, you would never see it actually enter it because of time dilation. I think that's interesting except it would be like how did Star Trek happen? Because it's like oh. I don't know. Fact number three. Freddie Mercury wrote Crazy little thing called love in under 10 minutes without knowing a single, a single guitar chord. That's like trying to be in a rock band and have a title song that's 30 seconds long, but you're just like, like playing on your guitar hero guitar over there. That's what that's like. I got a feeling my Black Eyed Peas sold more copies than any Elvis Presley single in its release. Did you know that nearly 1 in 10 American adults who have access to guns have a history of angry, impulsive behavior? That's that's dangerous. You need to know about that one, actually. That's a, that's a bad one. Did you know that the reason colors fade in the sun is because the sun's UV light rays are ripping the molecules apart? As you speak, all the sun that's coming through that window is destroying all the color in this room. That is why things become faded, is because the sun is ripping apart the colors molecules. Did you, know, did you know that while painting The Last Supper, Leonardo da Vinci may have used a real criminal to for the model of Judas? Makes sense. Did you, know, did you know that ants never get into traffic jams? This is due to the fact that they have receptors in their bodies that allow them to speed by each other without ever slowing down. That, so like, you know, when you're like on the ground or like, or like playing with ants as a little kid and they're like shooting by each other, they'll never run into each other. It's virtually impossible unless an ant is like dazed or something, I don't know. But they'll, ne they'll never run into each other, so I mean like, it's pretty interesting. Did you, did you know that the reason mold is so colorful is because it gives it a protection against UV light? Like, so we talked about this already. UV light rips apart color molecules. And so the reason mold is colorful is so the sun has to rip through those molecules before it can get to the mold. Also, it gives it extreme temperature survival rates and free radicals. I really don't know what that, that means, but pretty much mold is alive because of its color, which I think is kind of nasty. You might want to know that one too. Kind of dangerous. And finally, fact number 10. According to a study, only one in 661 people actually judges accurately judges how biased they are. So that means that you say you are biased. I mean, like, I'm probably in that 660 people who say that they're not biased. Because, I mean, like, who, who admits to that? I don't. Well, anyways, I hope you enjoyed that. Remember, leave in the comments down below if you want it this Thursday. And uh, also, right before I go, I forgot to tell you guys in the beginning that there will be three times during the summer I will not be able to post any videos during those weeks. I can't say what those weeks are, but this is the first week. Next week is the first week. 
then there's a week in July, the beginning of July, I'm pretty sure, and then in August, middle, mid-August or something like that, just so you guys know. Remember, thanks again, stay awesome, I'll see you guys in the next video.